what's going on y'all buddy workshop back with another episode and we're back at savers and we're trying to find hidden gems to the low as always so let's go find them just walked in and behind the counter they have these new balance 990 v4s they do have a little barricade here but i just reached over to see how much they were and what size they were they're size 14 they're here for 40 dollars which sigh sigh but let's keep looking all right guys i just met this dude zach I actually had his brother in a previous episode with the Hayes dunks if you haven't seen that episode definitely check it out but he found these jordan fives i feel like this pair came out before they did that artificial blue shade on the clear soles if you guys know what i'm talking about i'll put a picture right here so you know what i'm talking about check these out in decent condition in decent condition there's no paint cracking or anything it's a little creasing definitely been worn pre-loved here for $24.99 though definitely a great find and thanks for sharing these with me Zach definitely gonna check out Mass Collective and they actually have a Depop store so I'm gonna get the link I'm gonna put it in the description below check out his and his brother's Depop shop if you like vintage clothing definitely check it out also got this vintage polo sport quarter zip fleece just gotta hit it with a little lint roller and you'll be gucci but it got the little zippered pockets right there on the side got that vintage polo sport tag here for seven bucks also got this vintage fubu zip up windbreaker that royal blue red and black fubu sport collection embroidered on the back here fubu is a part of everybody's childhood it's just if you grew up you were a kid in the 90s or if you were even remotely involved in hip-hop hip-hop culture you know about fubu and this was a staple here for 12 bucks all right guys you've got this short sleeve nike running windbreaker with the reflective nike logo on there the zip up pockets with the reflective outline and it also has a little reflective material on the back here so if you're running on the streets cars and trucks will be able to see you and it also says just do it i'm not sure if the camera is picking it up there we go all over the fabric here and this was a wonderful find by my helpful assistant aria got to start them young all right getting the thrifts get get more eyes and hands on the racks finding these hidden gems for the left but this is here for 17 bucks now i normally refrain from checking out the children's shoes and sneakers they're normally absolutely destroyed the kids running around dragging their feet all around but check out these vintage nike ball kicks definitely from the 90s if i had to guess it's a little bit of golden yellow but these are so small, I don't think a kid ever actually walked in them. They're here for $7.50. Definitely gonna pick these up because you never know. You never know. You never know. The next day. All right, now hear me out. What we got here is a Foot Locker employee shirt. If someone were to purchase one of these and say go to their local Foot Locker and pull a prank that's pretty much all you would need right some black pants some fresh kicks like oh they sent me over from another store lock his ass up lock his ass up you're going to jail you're going to jail don't listen to me don't listen to me don't listen to me but it is here for $7.79 this windbreaker is pretty cool the Bergata Bermuda or Bermuda Regatta. This would be 10 times better if this logo was printed on the back here. That would make this cop worthy. But because it has just this little screen printed badge and logo right here, for $7.49, it's not a bad find, but I'm telling you, this was huge on the back there. It'd be undeniable here for $7.49. Check out this anorak. It says ambiguous clothing on the tag with a little skateboard graphic, but it also says ambiguous industries along the piping up there. I've never heard of this. I've heard of world industries, but never ambiguous. And it says 
It's like a little W to the third power. So I wonder if this is some sort of spin-off from World Industries around that time, like a sister brand or something. But I have no familiarity with it. Got ambiguous down the shoulder blade there. A little plastic tab on the back, as well as a little reflective logo on the sleeve. Little clear pull tabs on the bottom. All in all, this is a pretty, pretty hard Anorak. It also has a hood that pops out as well. Lots of lots of details that I could definitely appreciate. And it's only here for $11.99. I wish I had more familiarity with this brand now. And I actually have no idea what size it is. It says it's medium, but it's a little big. So, I don't know. If you know about Ambiguous clothing or industries, definitely drop a comment down below let me know because I gotta go do my homework. Popped over to the women's section, we've got this Polo Jeans Co. Ralph Lauren denim jacket. Ralph Lauren has had many sort of spin-off brands throughout the years. But when I think of Polo Jeans Co., I immediately think of that astronaut jacket, the NASA one that Drake wore in that song with Damn. What's his name? What's his name? I got nothing on a name. Come on, baby, what's the name? Damn, I can't remember his name right now, but you guys, you guys know what I'm talking about, right? But the Polo Jeans Co. NASA jacket. That's what immediately comes to mind. We've got this little denim jacket here for $14.99. Right next to this North Face zip-up. Little fuzzy fleece. It seems to be in pretty decent condition. A little linty, but if you hit this with the lint roller, you should be Gucci. It's an XL children's, so probably like a woman's small. It's only here for $4.49. Jesus Christ. If this is authentic and it's here for $5, that's a steal. We'll have to do our research, so let's, let's take a closer look at the tags and make sure. But it's looking, it's looking decent. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below. Also got this fairy zip up. Almost like a bomber, but definitely more fashionable than a traditional bomber jacket. It's here for $11.49. Not a bad find at all. And I can't really tell if this is like, sort of like a rayon reflective. It's not reflective, it's not reflective, but it has like a metallic look to it uh, that I just can't put my thumb on, but really like this. All right, guys, I just realized I did not record an ending for this video. I'm currently in Martha's Vineyard, but I want to announce the winner of the 1,000 subscriber giveaway. I used a random comment selection tool, and it landed on MS. And we were actually talking about his greatest find, or her greatest find, or their greatest find, and it was a pair of De La Soul Nike SBs that they found at Burlington. This was the high top version, and they ended up getting them and then returning them and regretting it. And although I use a random comment selection tool, I feel like that's a valuable lesson for all thrifters and diggers. You're gonna find something that you're gonna end up passing up on, and it's always gonna haunt you in the back of your mind, but that's what keeps us going out and looking for those hidden gems. So, MS, congrats. Everybody else, thanks for participating. There will definitely be more giveaways as the channel continues to grow, but as always, drop a comment down below. Let me know if there's anything that you liked. Let me know if there's anything that you absolutely did not like and you would not have caught. Let me know if there's anything in the background that I should pay more attention to, and I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm out, peace.